Hello, my name is Patricia. Today is the first time I'm making a video in English because my channel is more in French than in English. The fact I'm from France. <laughs> but the company Pop Sewing uh, decided to give me for free this bag to make for them. But I'm allowed to do, to say, to do what I want. The only thing I was, I was asked to is to do a video in English. That's why I'm here to do a video in English for you. That's why you see in the commercial here. It's the second time I'm making a pop sewing bag. The first time is a kit. It's a kit to arrive in a box. I make some video and I'm going to show you. It's not a DIY. My video is just going to show you the process when you receive this kit at home and how to do it. Uh, I really like it. In January, in February, sorry, February this year, I already made this bag here. This one, it was, uh, that's called that the Kelly Inspiration, I think. I'm going to put all the information on the information below my video. And this cat, this, uh, this kit I received in February and March, I was done. It was pretty long because it was the first time I was making a bag. I never make a bag myself. And I really, really like it. I carry them everywhere. When I went to France in Nice, when I went to Hawaii, when I went to Florida. And I like it because it's small, but you can put a lot of stuff. Passport, paper, wallet, what you want with it. And you can see, I cross the ocean on both ways. And I travel with it. It's not usually... When you travel with stuff, it doesn't stay in good shape. This one really stay in good shape. And I really like because it would like a, a beige color. You can see it's not really white. I really like for the summertime and the size of it. I really love it too. That way I want another one. And that's why today I'm interested in the new one I want. It look like a Lady Dior. Look like. I don't say it's the same. I don't say it's a copy. I don't say it's a fake, but it look like. I'll show you that right now. I received that kit in this beautiful envelope and it was very well packed and let me show you what there was inside don't lose the QR code the QR code is going to be scanned later on and you're going to get the video how to do your kit for the pop sewing video once you have the QR code scan it take a picture and when you take a picture you have a link on the website when you go to the website you have a different way to uh, contact the pop sewing company to send them an email and say hey I received that uh, kit can you please send me the video uh, let me show you whatever is inside the kit there were some scissors very practical scissors very small I'm not sure they're going to last but they last for the project there is some holder protection there I'm not sure I'm going to use it but there is a small piece of fabric of, of Leather. And on this kit, it's very nice because there is the the thread. The thread is uh, part of the kit. And the thread is a special thread to be able to sew the handbag. The thread they have some wax on it and it's a very strong thread. I finally received the link of, uh, in my WhatsApp. When I access the link, the only thing I really regret is there is commercial on the link. The second thing to is the voice on the background, but it's a subtitle is really good. it and it, this is from the video I just follow what they said to avoid it to have your thread going through the needle because when you do a handbag you have to pull on the thread very very strongly and you don't want your needle getting off of the thread because it's kind of pain in the ass <laughs> sorry for my expression anyway um, they assure you you take your needle and you go in between thread, the, the thread of the needle and you kind of blocking you thread. On this first step of sewing this handbag, they ask you to hand sew. The two small pockets going going to be inside the handbag. When you 
don't to finish your length of your thread, like example here, the pocket, they explain you two kind of way to finish it. You have the way to use it, some glue, I did not have it in my hand. Oh, you have the way to use it, the lighter. When you use the lighter like I did it, you have to leave your thread two little bit there, longer than it's supposed to, and after you burn it, they melt down, and after you tap it down to make sure they glue to each other. Here they show you how to answer the magnet for the flapping for the purse. I kept my leftover of the thread just in case I was going to not have enough, but don't worry about it. I done my bag and I have plenty enough for maybe another project. And there is this small piece of leather inside your kit and you put that inside. What you do is you remove it on the paper clip the metal part of it, you remove it, you make it through your piece of leather, there is already two holes already make it, you put it back and you paper clip on both sides and your leather go inside your paper clip. And when you using the paper clip on the top of your bag to hold in two pieces together, it's not going to damage your purse. Be careful when you start the first stitches and uh, when you have the length of the thread to make your thread very equal on each side. Uh, that's me. When you go into the first hole, make sure your two needle is on the same length. It's not one longer than the other one because you're going to have the issue at the going to have the step like we saw in two big pieces and when you saw in two big pieces you feel like okay that's going forward let's do it the video they show you how long you need your thread to be able to hand sewing the piece two different pieces together but they show you between bracket in centimeter I measure just to be curious and don't follow the measurement in centimeter follow the how many times you need five times on the the, the length of that piece you need ten times just follow that because the other one is 20 cm longer, 20 cm shorter, that the length doesn't correspond to something like Now the last step, I'm going to hand sew the all around the top of the bag. Let's do it. It was the end of the full project and my finger was kind of a little bit sore because it's a pretty hard project but beautiful and uh, I want to try this uh, finger protection and I hit it <laughs> my finger was getting so hot I was sweating and everything it was getting so tight it was too tight on my finger I don't think so it's made for my big fat finger there we go the new bag I made it I'm very very happy it looks very professional 
it looks standing up, it looks firm. I did not use it yet. I'm not sure how the scratch is going to hold it on the fabric here. It's uh, leather, they say. Um, I don't find it's too thick leather, I would say it's thin leather, but very, very good. I still did not remove the cover for the foot here, but uh, tonight I'm going to remove it. I'm going out. And because we had the 31st of December, the time I'm going to make the video is going to be 2024. I wish you a best year for 2024. And inside, with the two pockets, and there is a magnet. You can close it, your purse, secure with the two handle. There is a crossover if you want to cross over. I like for traveling sometimes to carry like this for tonight. I don't think so. I'm going to remove the crossover. But uh, for traveling sometimes it's like since it's nice to have two hand free, especially when you have kids, you have to hold the hand when you're at the airport. And um, on the video they show you to put that inside. And uh, I didn't like it because when you put it inside the handle stay like this and you have your crossover. I didn't like it. I prefer if you want to carry with a crossover linear it's just i prefer that outside this is we do what you want anyway i really like the size is i can see it's almost the same size as this one but except it's in black and i found for the winter i want something black to go more with all my more darker outfit than the lights outfit that's it for today i hope you like my first video in english uh, if you like it, don't forget the thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe it. Let me know in the comments if you want more video in English. Maybe I will create an English channel and this one I will keep in French. Up to you. I say bye. Au revoir. <laughs>